Hi, let's solve for x. First, when you have a to the power of m multiplied by a to the power of n is equal to a to the power of m plus n. We are going to express this then as 3 to the power of x plus x plus x, which is equal to what? 15. So we have 3 to the power of x plus x plus x is 3x is equal to 15. Now we are going to introduce log to both sides of this equation. Yes, because the power is what we are looking for. That is the only thing that can bring it down. Log or ln, okay? So let's introduce log to both sides. So we have log 3 to the power of 3x is equal to log 15. When you have log a raised to the power of b is equal to b multiplied by log a. So we can write this as 3x multiplied by log 3 is equal to log 15. Now, because we are looking for the value of x, let's divide both sides by log 3. So we have 3x log 3 divided by log 3 is equal to log 15 divided by log 3. Now, when log 3 divides itself, we have 1. 3x times 1 will give us 3x is equal to log 15 divided by log 3. Okay? All right. So we have 3x is equal to, let us express 15 in terms of 3. 15 in terms of 3 is 5 multiplied by 3. So we have log 5 multiplied by 3 divided by log 3. Okay? Now, when you have log A multiplied by B is equal to log A plus log B. Yes. So, that means that we can write this as 3x is equal to log 5 plus log 3 divided by log 3. I would like you to hit the subscription button, turn on your notification bell. If this is the first time you have seen this amazing face, yes and please give us a thumbs up if you're actually enjoying this video thank you very much now back to what we are doing so we have 3x then is equal to log 5 divided by log 3 plus log 3 divided by log 3 okay now log 3 we divide itself and we have 1 so what we have here now is 3x is equal to log 5 divided by log 3 plus 1. Now, when you have log A divided by log B, log A over log B, according to the law of log reading, this is equal to log A base B. So, we can write this as 3x is equal to log 5 base 3 plus 1. Now remember that we are looking for the value of x and not the value of 3x. So that simply means that we need to divide both sides of this equation by 3 in order to get the value of x. I know what you have in mind. We are not yet done. Don't miss the amazing part of this video where we prove that the answer we got is correct. Yes, that is the most interesting aspect of this video. Don't miss that. So stay tuned. Let's continue with what we are doing. Do not go anywhere. So we have 3x is equal to, sorry, yeah. Let's divide both sides by 3, right? So 3x divided by 3 is equal to log 5 base 3 plus 1 divided by 3. Now 3 we divide itself. We have 1. 1 times x is x. So we have x is equal to 1 plus, let me write this first. 1 plus log 5 base 3, everything divided by 3. Now, to the most interesting aspect of this video. Yes, let's prove that the answer we got is right. So according to the question, the question says that 3 to the power of x multiplied by 3 to the power of x multiplied by 3 to the power of x is equal to 15. Now, let's see if that is true. Now, our x is 1 plus log 5 base 3 divided by 3. So it's going to be 3 
to the power of 1 plus log 5 base 3, everything divided by 3, multiplied by 3 to the power of 1 plus log 5 base 3 divided by 3, multiplied by 3 to the power of 1 plus log 5 base 3 divided by 3 is equal to 15. Now remember that a to the power of m multiplied by a to the power of n. Remember how we did it? It's same thing as a to the power of m plus n. So this is going to be 3 to the power of this plus this plus this, which is same thing as 3 multiplied by this, right? 3 multiplied by 1 plus log 5 base 3 divided by 3 is equal to 15. Let me come to this side. Now remember, remember that a to the power of m raised to the power of n is equal to a to the power of m times n. Okay? So, excuse me. I'm sorry. So, that means that you can solve this as 3 to the power of 3 multiplied by 1 plus log 5 base 3 divided by 3 is equal to 15. So, this we definitely divide that and we have 1. So what we now have is 3 to the power of 1 times whatever we have here. We still give us the same thing. 1 plus log 5 base 3 is equal to 15. Now, is that really the right thing? Let's see. Remember that a to the power of m plus n is equal to a to the power of m multiplied by a to the power of n. Right? Yes. So that means that we can write this as 3 to the power of 1 multiplied by 3 to the power of log 5 base 3 is equal to 15. Now, 3 to the power of 1 is 3 multiplied by, remember that when you have a to the power of log b base a, that this is equal to b. Okay? Yes. So that simply means that this can be written as, since they have the same base, this can be written as 5 is equal to 15. 3 times 5 is 15. And 15 is equal to 15. So that proves that the answer we got is correct. Thank you so much for watching. See you in my next video. Bye.